day four check-in of my OMAD weight loss journey 2023. I'm doing OMAD one meal a day for the month of February and probably beyond, but I'm sticking to this 28-day challenge. I'm going to say everybody's name that did a good job yesterday for day three. I'm going to share what I ate in my OMAD yesterday. And first, I'm going to say a few notes. I took a very few notes I took while um, reading everybody's comments, those that are on the challenge. First, I want to say send condolences to Annie Says It because her father passed away and she won't be able to continue because she needs to take care of family. Um, yes, I'm really sorry to hear that. If you have a slight mess up on your day challenge, um, it's to your discretion whether you tell me if you did good or not. If you say you messed up or went over your calories or over and it looked like you did not do a successful day, then I'm going to put a dot instead of a shade. Um, this is using the honor system, so you know if you earned a colored box or not. Please, listen. Some people don't have their two items still, so you can't get a shaded box if you are not doing two things. So if you said work out three days a week or four days a week, and you worked out, worked out, and then one day you don't, um, you have to have something in replace of that because we have, the only way you get a color box, and I know I keep repeating myself, um, is if you do two items that are beneficial to you, the ones that you committed to on the beginning of this challenge. You could see the spreadsheet. I'll put a link to the spreadsheet in the description, the original one that says what you committed to. If you said three times or four times or five times, I have to have an, a seven days worth of commitment. It doesn't have to be the same thing. It could be easy. It could be hard. It could be whatever you're committed to for these 28 days. Okay, next, let me see. Carbs. Carbs don't like me. That's what I have concluded. I still believe all diets work. Um, I feel puffy. I feel puffy. I feel good, though. I feel like I've been making excellent choices, in my opinion, for me. Um, I've been having lots of vegetables, tons of vegetables, a lot of fruits. Yesterday was not the best because someone bought me, my client yesterday brought me barbecue gates. That's like a popular, um, barbecue place here. And he brought me a sandwich. Um, I did eat that. You're going to see it in the end of this video. I did eat half on my way home. Yes. On my way to get my son that I had to sit at Taco Bell for two hours because he couldn't get a ride home. <laughs> um, and then I ate the rest with a few other things when I got home. It was still an OMAD. It was still in a short window. I consider OMAD one meal a day eating at that moment, not hours and hours of an eating window. I consider hours intermittent fasting windows. Um, OMAD is also intermittent fasting, but I just don't believe in going two or three hours doing OMAD, I don't really see. I feel like that's more OMAD plus a snack, which I will be doing when I get to um, probably at the end of this month when we get off of this challenge. I want to do my Live Good Protein Shake with um, by itself at a different time than my OMAD. Okay, that is my plan and that is what I got to stick to. And when this challenge is over, I cannot have a day off. Because I have a day off, I had four days off, and that was really absolutely terrible. And I'm not talking about that anytime soon, maybe in a week or two. When I have to weigh in, maybe I'll talk about that. I did my 20 minutes of not being in my bed with my phone. That was a success yesterday on day four of this OMAD challenge. If you have a YouTube channel, you're going to get a highlight on the sheet. Only if you, you tell me you have a channel and you have done a video within the last seven days. Why? Because your subscribers subscribe because they like you. They want to see your content and you have to give them what they want, okay? So at least a minimum of once a week, even if you do a short, which could take 15 seconds, um, very simple, no excuses. Um, you did a channel for some kind of reason. I don't know what it is, but yeah, give your people something, okay? So I'll highlight your name and then other people might want to come check out your videos. Okay, channel, no links. It'll go to spam and we're not putting links here, even though I'm gonna put my Live Good link down below, but yeah, this is my channel. Um, but I do wanna give you guys 
um, recognition for your channels if you have them, okay? If you have questions about that, if you want to start a channel, now is the time because this video will stay on YouTube for years and years and years and years. So someone might watch it and then you get a shout out for your channel. You know, some people got to pay for shout outs. All you have to do is be on this list and keep grinding and give your viewers a minimum of one um, video per week. And I'm not saying I'm going to do this in March because some people might just try to join the challenge just to get shout outs for the channel. No, I'm just doing that right now. Okay. Um, let me see. Now here I'm going to read everybody that checked in for day three and had a successful day. If your name is not called, either you didn't check in or I didn't see it because you did not put it in the correct spot. It has to be in the video. That's marked day one, day two, day three, not in the community post. Not in any other places, okay? So, great job to Erin, Penny All In Her Movements, Amy Waithen, Angel, Errol Dia, Bar Exam Fitness, Bree Jean, Carol Arias, Colleen Judkins, Dirty Fasting Life, Donna Said, Eden, EJQT, Elizabeth Booth, Fruta H, Healthy Days, Hello World, His Way Cost, Jessica Rana, Jojo McCommons, Juan Perez, Candy Keith, Karen Akins, Kimberly's Weight Loss and Spiritual Journey, Kimmy's Crossing, Lady T, Laura Pechon, Lisa Keys, Marcy, Mika Mika, Mercy Ferguson, Molly Cash, Mudawa TM, Nefer's Notes, Nicole, we have new, two Nicoles. Um, if I, one's Nicole and one's Nicole Joseph. Um, Nikki Speaks, Ocean Blue, Rahama Machu, Raham, Rahama Macha. Okay, um, I'm gonna get that right. I don't even know if I'm saying it right, but I'm gonna keep trying until I can say it right. Robin Hargrove, Rose Schneider, Samantha B, Sapna Dua, Shapali Kanam. Sharon Wright Green, Silky Black, Susan McGee, TDR Justice 3, Tech Cowgirl, VLV1028. Great job, everyone that I called. If I didn't call you, remember, you might have a dot or a blank. Dot means I didn't see two commitments. And blank means you didn't check in. A quick thing for those of you that are learning a language, I'm going to show my food at the end. I'm going to show my... Let me show my food now. Here's my OMAP for today. One of my clients bought me Gates. They bought me chicken and beef sandwich. And I have a taco from Taco Bell. And I have, this is my dessert plate. I have, these are from Taco Bell and celery with cream cheese and peanut butter. And this is everything I'm eating today. Okay, those of you that are learning a language, um, one thing that is really cool is to turn your phone settings to that language because you're forced to learn those things the reason why i said that is as i'm reading people's names and it's they they're they may be from a different country their alphabet and the way i'm pronouncing it might be different so i just yeah that just reminded me that that's a good tool to use if you really are trying to learn a language change your settings on your phone it'll be hard but you'll learn i've learned a lot of spanish words having my settings in spanish i turned them back to english um I need to turn them back again, but I had them for quite a few months and I learned a lot of words. Thank you for watching all the way to the end.